we're right on the main trail here that I've been on so many times before. We have a beautiful little adolescent rattlesnake. Beautifully. See how he is completely... Oh, now he's on the move. But do you see how he is completely flattened out? And also, what I want you guys to notice is he was just flattened out right on the trail. And uh, I found him because uh, a lady and a gentleman just said, uh, hey, be careful, there's a little snake up here. And they picked up their dog and off they went. And there he goes, number one for today. Real beauty. I saw him just off to the side of the trail. <laughs> He's actually behaving quite well. Not striking, not really rattling. He's just chilling, sniffing the air, seeing if there's any threat. And of course, we're not food, so he's not gonna be too crazy about it. Remember, these guys can only strike about a third to half their body length, and he's not in a strike position right now, so he's not gonna hit my phone or anything. He's just checking it out. Trying to get back to his home. I'm gonna take a few photos, and then we'll let this guy on his way. Look what we have here this morning, boys and girls. Nice little guy, adolescent, just cruising across the trail, right here in old trusty Shell Ridge. Let me see if I can get him to curl up a little bit for you. He seems pretty calm. Yeah. Nice. I'm gonna take a few still photos. Here in just a second. As you can see, here we go. I don't know if I hit record earlier. Uh, what I was saying is, sun's out, snake's out. It's a great little adolescent guy. I'm gonna take a few photos and uh, send him on his way. Pretty snake. Every day, Shell Ridge. second see what he's gonna do yeah, he's good all right Alexis or stop this guy is a nice color look at him you don't see a lot of the greener colored rattlers out here again I'm at uh, Shell Ridge, um, just out for a run. This is number two for today. Um, let me see if I can zoom in just a little bit there. He's calm, he's not pissed off. He's just doing his thing, passing the trail. I saw his head just sticking out, just enough uh, for me to see him. <laughs> well, <laughs> I don't know, I actually almost ran into him. And I was like, whoa, look at him. Great snake. Okay, I'm gonna take a few pictures uh, and uh, let this guy be on his way. Here we are. Shell Ridge never disappoints. Right here on the main trail, all the kids walking having fun he's sorry I'm out for a run he's tracking me right now kind of seeing what's going on but like I said that's right here main trail got a bicyclist coming let me get out of the shadow here oh he's gonna give us some nice video here I've got a treat for you today, guys. Look at this. Another king snake right here. I saw a lady stopped. He's just passing the on the trail right here. Gorgeous snake. This one's a little bit calmer than the one uh, I think was it this morning or yesterday.
But this guy, I mean, they're big. Look how big this guy is. I mean, he's a, he's a healthy cat. I'm gonna play with him just for a few more minutes here. See if we can get you a nice face shot. He's real calm. He's not striking at all. I know, uh, I know a lot of people say that. Really? Where at? Back to like 100 feet. Oh, crap. I just heard there's a rattlesnake up here, so we're going to go check for the rattlesnake real quick. Hold on here. All right, what you guys see here is a rattlesnake right on the trail. This is the main um, trail to uh, the Borges Ranch area. And I just wanted to stop and show these guys this cool, uh, cool snake. He's completely chill. He's not in a strike position. He's got uh, maybe like four or five little nubs on him. But uh, cool snake. Oh, shh. Don't, don't edit that part out. <laughs> And we're just gonna let him be on his way. If you do come across a rattlesnake, don't play with them. That's it. Have a great day. Um, we're just walking right through here. And if you notice, we got off to the side, right where kids and everybody play. I'm gonna bring him up for a little photo session here. Real pretty guy. Um, and again, I think, I think you saw how close he was to the trail. So when you have your kids or your pets running and not paying attention, just off to the side, whoops, sorry buddy, um, that's where these guys are basically sitting, getting ready to cross, hang out. Notice he's not real aggressive, he's not, he's not, uh, he's not striking, he just wants off the trail. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and stop the video here. And, uh... All right, let's look at this guy. Now I've got this on a selfie stick, so uh, <laughs> don't be doing this at home, especially, uh, <laughs> especially if you're holding your phone. Notice I have a, a, a snake stick just to get him in a nice pose. And, uh, you know, it is kind of challenging doing both. Uh, but, let's see if I can get him over here for a second. Get some really good video. All right, that looks pretty good. Look at that. Pretty guy. I'm gonna let them blend in just a little bit. Just give you guys an idea of what you're walking over if you're on the sides of the trail. This is exactly how I found him. See the trail? He's right in here. He was poking his head up again. Oh, <laughs> so he's getting, getting a little closer to his home, so he's gonna get a little uh, more excited. I'm gonna let him cross through here because this is the way he was going. So. Off he goes. Cool snake. Okay, we're just chilling along. And look at what is sprawled out right on the single track. Now, if it was a dog, guess who's gonna get a, a little uh, exciting nip? Now, this looks a lot like a gopher snake, doesn't it? Well, the telltale signs is he's got a real puffy head. See his puffy head? Those are venom glands because he's a pit viper. And in the back here, see we got the little black tail with the nubs. So that is going to be your Northern Pacific rattlesnake. Now I've got a tongs, uh, not tongs, I've got a little hook with me today. So I'm going to go ahead and just give him a little hello because I want him off the trail. I, I don't want a mountain bike. Uh, you know what? He's so calm. Let me just see if we can get a really good close-up photo of him. What's up, buddy? How you doing? 
You know, maybe I'll take a couple photos of him. He's really calm. Stand by. Oh, look at this little guy. Look at this little nub. Look at that little nub. He's so cute. But uh, seriously, on a serious note, guys, no, seriously, on a serious note, if I can be any more serious than I already am, he can really cause you some serious hurt. Look where he is. Right here. See that? And let's see if you can see him as we walk by. Are you guys going to see that? Look at that. Huh? He's right there. Come on, buddy. We gotta go. You gotta go off the trail here, sorry. I know you're trying to get warm and stuff, but it's time to go. It's time to go. Time to go. Time to go. Off into the woods with ya. Off into the woods. Off into the woods. There he goes. Good boy. Don't surprise any hikers. Don't bite a dog. A little nature photo here. And he stalled out. Isn't he cool? There you go. Northern Pacific Rattlesnake, Shell Ridge, number 25 this year. All right, here we have come across one of nature's great moments. I'm so excited to see this. Um, we have a king snake that is eating a gopher snake. He's got the gopher. He doesn't have its head and he doesn't have its tail. Um, he's actually looking for its tail. You can see his head right down here. He's gonna try to swallow this puppy. I'm gonna stick around here for a few minutes and see if we can catch this on film. And there it's happening. snake has got the gopher snake's head in its mouth and he's going to slowly eat the snake alive. cut for a second he comes back and lifts his head up a little bit I'll try to get some more video look what we have here guys I'm not gonna get too close I'm on a mountain bike ride the our we got two king snakes and well they might be done mating or they're still mating super cool 
I'm gonna try to get a little closer without them uh, freaking out too much. How cool is this? Wow! Right here on the uh, right here on the trail too. That's just amazing. What a find! I uh, can't believe I've been so lucky these last few days with all these just killer finds. I'm, I'm gonna stay here, he knows I'm here, so I'm gonna, I'm not gonna get any closer. Sounds like someone's on a mountain bike like my bike. Oh, he's biting himself, what's he doing that for? Interesting. I really don't know what stage they're at right now. This could be foreplay or could be complete. I'm not quite sure. I don't speak snake. Let's see if I can get a little uh, close up on the, on the goings on here. Assuming that this is some kind of uh, mating ritual because they're not really eating each other, so that's my first clue. Very interesting. Talk about perfect timing. These are uh, California king snakes. They're not venomous. And for the most part, they're not really um, too jumpy, crazy. Usually they're pretty calm. They both see me there. I, I think uh, I think they don't care right now. Just cool stuff. Oh, no, 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 no. You gotta be kidding me. So, well, are we done? I think we're done. Okay. All right. Whatever that was, um, maybe they were thinking about uh, eating each other, or uh, maybe that was just a mating dance. I'm not sure, but here you are. To uh, Two king snakes. Just a sight that you don't see every day. Going on their way. Oh, thanks for the shows, guy. Or thanks for the show, guys. Gary's Nature Channel. Never disappoints. Another guy right here. Nice looking. Nice looking gopher snake. Oh, he's gonna bite me. <laughs> He's gonna bite me. Oh, <laughs> uh, anyway, he was right on the trail. I was just kind of moving him off. Don't want him to hurt himself. I'm gonna take a picture and let him on his way. All right, saying hi to my little buddy today. This is another Northern Pacific rattlesnake. Was just crossing the trail. I was lucky enough to uh, grab him out of the old. Uh... <laughs> We got, we got some people coming up. Let's see what the response is when they uh, <laughs> when they see our little friend here. Head. Yeah, yeah, he's not he's not a big guy. 
Howdy, howdy. How are you guys? Hey. A little bit. Well, actually, be a little careful. It's a rattlesnake. Oh. Yeah, yeah. He was he was just crossing like right here. I'm using a selfie stick, so I'm definitely not actually. I got caught a weed. I'm definitely not getting this close with my phone. This is just for you guys to take a peek. Really nice, nice looking guy there. Northern Pacific rattlesnake. Um, I'm gonna have to uh, get him on the move on though, cause he's kind of under my bike. So <clears throat> I don't want him to bite my tire by accident. So come on, come on, get going. I'm gonna poke him a little bit with the stick. See if I can get him on the move. Come on, there we go. And off he goes. Beautiful snake, beautiful. Just a beautiful color too. I'm really stoked to have found this guy. Uh, you know, you've heard the story, right on the trail, same, same story. Today's Shell Ridge, we got a nice little juvenile rattler. He's, uh, he's pretty calm, not going too crazy. You see him smelling the air. <laughs> That's my buddy Steve, doing a little shadow, tickling him. We're gonna take a few photos and then put him on his way. Oh, you hear him breathing? Do me a favor, it might I wanted pack. to give you guys a nice up close look. This guy, I am using a selfie stick. I don't want you guys to think that I'm, I want, you can hear him breathing. I'm not trying to get too close to him because I don't want him to strike and hurt himself. He's just smelling the air, chilling, looking for a, looking for a threat. This is a strike position. So if, if you run across a rattlesnake in this position, he is in a strike position. He's good to go in that position, about a third of his body. In this case, we're looking about maybe a f 10, 12, 12 inches at most. But uh, you definitely want to give him respect. I'm gonna let this guy move on his way. Go, sit, stay. <laughs> what a beautiful snake. get a little bit closer here. Whoops. There we go. Look at that. You can hear him breathing. Yeah. It's not. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah. I don't like him to do that because they can hurt themselves. Uh, yeah. So he's getting cranky. We're going to let him cruise on into the, into the field there. We have here we're doing a little snake removal tim turn around let me show your uh show your contact dayton snake removal and relocation he basically found this guy well i'll let you tell the story what's uh what's going on i got a call this morning for a uh, snake removal out of a garage in antioch and uh, luckily they don't kill him which pleases me um non-venomous snake it's a gopher nice beauty That's a good looking snake. And, That's uh, a healthy. So yeah, I'm gonna do a release on it here at Lime Ridge. Put it back in the wild, give it a chance. All right, let's let her- uh, Here we go. Let's let her go and see where she goes. And just like that, back to nature. <laughs> 